you are listening to Elon Musk Radio. The world's first online radio station, 100% dedicated to Elon Musk and the companies he runs. Elon Musk Radio was created for people who are too busy to read about Elon Musk. Have you heard of OpenAI? If you haven't, it's a company that researches and develops AI, founded in 2015 by Elon Musk and other billionaires. OpenAI is famous for a bunch of their work, for example, Dall-E, GPT-3 and Codex. What's Dall-E? Dall-E is an image-generating AI that can generate any image just by giving it a description of what you want to make. For example, you can ask it to make an astronaut riding a horse on the moon and it will generate that. It can make anything, from realistic images, to completely abstract ones. Dolly works by looking at a database of images with their respective labels, then it plays a game where it has to guess what's what, and more it plays that game more it understands the rules and gets some right, then it creates a database of its own or a latent space, where it classifies things for where they belong to, by its color, shape, and lots of more parameters. Dolly in fact has 12 billion parameters used to classify things in its latent space. Then having all this data, it gets the prompt you gave him, goes look in the latent space for correlations between the prompt and what the object is, and then, from random noise, it generates a beautiful image. Dolly has so many capabilities that I think it will also be used to invent new products. In the near future, I could give a future version of Dolly that can produce video, a prompt saying an Elon Musk radio episode, and it will make that for me. That's why Dolly is amazing, and it will get better and better, surpassing traditional content creators and graphics designers. As for GPT-3, it's an AI that instead of generating images, it generates text. You can chat with GPT-3, you can ask questions to GPT-3, you can even make GPT-3 generate an entire story or poem. In the near future entire newspapers will be completely written by AI. GPT-3 can almost seem human by the way it writes. Codex instead is an AI that can generate code just by telling the AI what it has to do, for example you can just tell it to make something bigger and it will. Just tell the AI what it has to write as code and it will do that. These three AI are like the gemstones in Thanos' gauntlet, they are super powerful. One can create images and soon videos, one generates text and one generates code. I think OpenAI will get involved in the creation of Tesla's robot, Optimus. I think this because Elon Musk still is half involved with OpenAI, and still donates large quantities of money to OpenAI. And because of this I think OpenAI will partner up with Tesla to make the Optimus robot. OpenAI could also help Tesla achieve level 5 autonomous driving on their cars. You have been listening to Elon Musk Radio. The world's first online radio station, 100% dedicated to Elon Musk and the companies he runs.